Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to a brand new Roblox Studio video. My name is Floppy, and today guys, I'm going to be showing you how to make joining and leaving messages. So to start off, we're going to want to make sure Explorer and Properties are open. If Explorer and Properties are not open, we want to click on the top bar here and click on View. And then we want to enable Explorer and Properties. So now that we've enabled Explorer and Properties, we want to head over to Replicated Storage. And we want to click the plus button next to Replicated Storage. We then want to insert a folder. And we want to rename this folder to events okay just copy everything and how i name it because without copying what i do the script will not work so we want to name the folder events then what you're going to want to do is click the plus button next to events and insert a remote event we want to insert two of these and then we want to rename one to joining and then one to leaving So now that we've inserted a script into workspace, we then want to go and remove all the previous code that is in the script. And you want to go down to the description of this video, copy the first script that is at the top of the description. You'll see there's there's two multiple scripts in this tutorial. There are two scripts. So choose the, the script that is higher, that is above the other one, script one. Then you want to bring that back to Roblox Studio and paste it into the script. Just go Control V or right click paste and insert the code into the script. So now that we've inserted the code into the script that is in workspace, we then want to go and click the X next to the script and we want to head over to start a GUI. We then want to click the plus button next to start a GUI and insert a local script. We then want to remove all the previous code that is in the local script and we want to go down to the description of this video, copy and paste the second and the last script that is in the description, bring it back to Roblox Studio, copy and so now that we've inserted the code into the local script in Starter GUI, you can go and customize it to whatever you would like. So you can change the text, okay? You can change it from has joined the game. So basically what will happen is the person's Roblox username or their display name will show up before this. So for example, right now it is currently saying it's underscore floppy fish has joined the game. If you wanted to make it it's underscore floppy fish has joined the experience you just change the game to experience basically this is where you adjust the text of what um, is said when someone joins the game you are also able to adjust the color of the text so currently we have it on kind of like a sign like a light blue more like uh, you are also able to adjust the font of the text so currently we have it on source sans bold which is fine and you are also able to adjust the size of the text that it shows up in chat. And you can always adjust the, the leaving um, message um, that happens here. You can It's literally the same up here. You've got the text, you can change the text, you can change the color, you can change the font, and you can also change the font size. So once you're finished adjusting the script, we want to go up here and click X next to the script up here. And let's go test it out. So we just want to click on play. And as you guys can see, we have just loaded in and in the chat, it says it's underscore floppy fish has joined the game. If you guys are a little bit lost or you don't really know what you're doing, feel free to send me a message on Discord and I'll happily help you out. But anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap up the video here. If you did enjoy, I'd appreciate it if you do consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel. I'd really appreciate it. But anyway, have a lovely rest of your day and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace.